committed kuhakikisha tume serve ndio maana hata last time tulikuwa kuna pasta sasa hivi pia tumeweka bishop nyatuka kwa sababu nataka wawe watu wa Mungu ili waweze kusabu watu wetu vizuri sasa nataka kuzungumza kuhusu uh, Kenya yetu najua wengi wengi mmeona tumekuwa na demonstrations baba ameita demonstrations na tumepoteza watu wengi uh? polisi wamekuwa high handed wameshoot watu wengi lakini kitu nataka kuambia mimi ile kitu imenikosesha ime penda demonstration ni kwa sababu 2017 hii Nairobi yangu tulizika 97 people 97 walikufa 2017 na saa hii hapa Nairobi najua almost 10 or 15 people wamekufa mimi sitaki mtu yoyote akufe kwa sababu ya siasa tumemalizana na siasa lakini hiyo haisemi kuwa vile baba anazungumza haifai kusikizwa wajua lazima tuangalie ile uchaguzi na vile inafanywa 2022 8 billion people did not vote 2027 itakuwa zaidi ya 10 million kwa sababu watu hawana confidence na the election body na it is important to build confidence in the election body kwa sababu hiyo ndio the democratic right ya kuhakikisha that you are represented ukienda senate ukienda county ukienda parliament kila pahali kutoka MCA mpaka president as a voter you are looking for representation na hakuna haki mbaya kuchukuliwa kama ile ya free fair credible elections so mimi ninaomba kuwa tutafika wakati kwa sababu access to information is a right for every kenyan hata baba akiuliza open the servers anajua vile anazungumza tufungue servers kama vibaya zimetendeka turekebishe vile na kwa nini ilitendeka lazima tufanye hivyo okay kitu nataka kusema hiyo ndio haki baba anatafuta si yake kwa sasa ruto ni president ashakuwa sworn in the supreme court even declare lakini going forward in the future tunataka elections yetu iwe kitu ambao kila mtu ataamini imeenda vizuri so hiyo ni kitu ambao i'm supporting baba 100% ile kitu ambayo ingine baba anaitikia ni kilio ya wa Kenya kwa chakula imekuwa gali stima imekuwa gali na petroli imekuwa gali kazi hakuna na hizo vitu ninajua pia serikali inasema lazima tupate taxes na tukikolect taxes tutaweza kuitimiza hizi vitu zote tuliachiwa hatuna pesa tumesikia pesa ime iliachiliwa hakuna pesa hata sijui kwa nini ina ni system zetu ni mbaya sana kama serikali moja inaondoka na inaondoka na pesa yote ya Kenya iwezekani eh, kama kuna kitu kama hiyo waende jela kwa sababu if you have proof the people stole money and left the coffers of central bank empty why are they not arrested why are they not arrested arrest everybody who stole money and left the country coffers empty so that is kenyan money that is sex payers money so kama unataka taxes zilipwe zaidi unasema taxes zilipwe zaidi tutajua haja utaweza kuprotect hizo taxes kama mtu akiondoka office anaondoka hata unasikia kwa counties counties magama na wanasema iliachwa empty we have a problem that is not personal money that is the money that belongs to kenyans to all of you so kitu ninasema serikali inahitaji taxes hata president alitwambia lazima tuwaambie watu walipe ushuru ha? ili aweze kununua bidhaa na kupatia watu services hospitali zipate pesa si kwa sababu walipwe ha? watu ambao wamefanya contracts pia walipwe nimeona video zikitendeka watu ambao wamefanya kazi kwa serikali na hawajalipwa mpaka wamepata wazimu ha? that is wrong So what we need to do mimi ninaomba kwa baba na ruto wakae pamoja wazungumze hali ya Kenya na vile tunaweza kuirekebisha kwa sababu Kenya inafaa kurekebishwa ili sisi sisi kama wa Kenya tuangalie Kenya yetu iwe nzuri tupatie watoto wetu
Atutaki Kenya itomeke. Atutaki Kenya yanguke. Tunataka Kenya iende mbele. Ha? Mandamano si mbaya. Mandamano is a democratic right. Ha? Mandamano is a democratic right. Na pili kuna shida. Ngoja nikwambie shida iko wapi? Tukienda peaceful mandamano hakuna shida. Lakini tukifanya maandamano ambayo itakuja kuleta uwizi. Ulea uliona vile nitendeka kibra. Msikiti ilianguka, kanisa ilichomeka, watu walipoteza bidhaa yao. Wajua maandamano ubaya ubaya ya Kenya sahi kuna watu wengi sana hawana kazi. Kuna watu wengi sana wamekasirika. Na hao watu wakienda maandamano kuna hata wale ambao wana uliwakora. Wakiingia hapo ndani wanaanza kuharibu kila kitu. Sasa wewe niulize kama tunataka kutendeza kazi Kenya hii. Na tunaonesha wale investors kuwa Kenya is unsafe. Nani atakuja na pesa yake kuweka Kenya? Tutatendeza kazi yaje. So kama tunataka maandamano let us do peaceful demonstration. Ha? Peaceful demonstration. Na wale watu wa siasa ambao wanalipa ili maandamano peaceful yaribike lazima tuwajue na tuwatangaze ili tuwe na peaceful demonstration kwa sababu hiyo ni haki ambayo sisi kama wa Kenya tumepigania miaka nyingi sana si ndio nimeona hapa watu kweli wanataka maandamano si ndio